The day is finally here. Baldur's Gate 3. Been waiting for this one a long time. Been watching all the videos through early access and reading reviews. And uh, supposedly one of the greatest RPGs of all time. Super detailed, super interesting, and the world is just dynamic. It changes with you. The missions are interesting. So without further ado, here's my raw, uncut playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3. I'm going to make some mistakes. I'm not going to get all the trophies. Uh, I'm going to miss things, but uh, we're going to have fun. And thanks for joining on this journey with me together. Here we go. I'm going to go new game. I did start it already, and I started the character creation just to get kind of learn how it works so I don't take too much time doing that. Um, but I am going to create my character from scratch on this playthrough. Um, I don't talk a lot during cutscenes. I try to be quiet, let you guys enjoy them with me. Um, but I might make a comment here and there. Here we go. As always, I don't do too easy. I don't do too hard. We go right in the middle. Let's have some fun. Jeez. Oh God. Well, looks like me and my friends were all trapped or something. Some weirdo stuck a worm in our eyes. That was strange. Uh, so basically on this custom, uh, I'm sorry, on the character creator, you can either do a custom one, which I'm gonna do for this playthrough, uh, but you can also do like a pre-built uh, character that has an origin story and whatnot. Uh, it's kind of cool, they, they give you an introduction as to who they are, but I believe, and from everything I've seen, you are gonna meet these uh, folks along the way, and they either join your party or you're gonna learn more about them later. So. We can kind of skip these, because um, I'm not going to use them, but uh, you know what? I, I'd like to see at least this one, because I'm not uh, going to be this kind of character, this race, but uh, I'm interested to see what they're about, so let's, let's hear the introduction. chest and made me her prize soldier but i've escaped now thank you mind flayers and i've got a few scores to settle if this engine doesn't burn me to ash first i'll need people i can trust an infernal mechanic and a serious amount of luck but you know what i'm not worried after 10 years in the hells i can take on anything i've got my chance at freedom and believe me I'm going home. Okay, she seems pretty badass. Was like, 
basically made to be a fighter. Uh, but now, again, let's make our own character here. I've learned a good amount about it uh, and what I want to be. Uh, we're going to go with race first. I want to be this drow. Uh, if you look at all the cool stuff this thing has, uh, first, driven to the Underdark, most drow have adopted a ruthless pragmatism. Uh, while the Lolth sworn delight in this goddess's evil tenants, the Selendrian reject her attempt to overthrow the leader of the Elven Pantheon. So, uh, actually, let's watch an origin story about one of these. Oops. Wizard, half-elf. Are we going to get a drow? Actually, I don't know if there is one. Hmm. No, there's not, but... Uh, Anyway, I want to be kind of a mix between a sorcerer and I, uh, but it can use swords up close. And th this seems to have what I'm looking for here. So uh, we're gonna go race, we're gonna go drow, because right here has this illuminates it with a nine meter radius. Uh, I cannot stand uh, darkness in video games. I like them if I'm playing like a horror game, but I hate when I'm going through a cave and you can't see anything. So to light things up is going to be just up, right up my alley. Uh, high perception, so can uh, observe the environment, spot hidden things that leads to more treasure, leads to more enemies being discovered, things like that. Uh, got nine speed. I, I assume that's good. I don't know. Uh, proficiency uh, with rapier, short, short swords, and hand crossbow. So this person can, or thing, uh, can uh, hit you with a sword or use the crossbow. Can see in the dark up to 24 meters. Again, huge for me. Uh, you have an advantage on saving throws against being charmed and magic can't put me to sleep. I don't know if you've ever played these types of games, but... Uh, being put to sleep in the middle of a fight is one of the worst things ever, so not happening. This is my perfect character, so we're going to go with it. Um, and we're going to go male. I want a big hulk. Not too thin and small. We want a big, crazy wizard right there. I kind of like this build already. Um, let's review him. Go right to the appearance. I kind of like how that looks. Huh, let's hear the voices. Where to next? No. Hmm. What was that? Let's hope the locals are friendly. Hells, something just woke up down here. Be wary. This plate. It's opened. I wonder what's back there. More of those wreck. There's magic keeping this chest sealed. I can feel its aura. That looks like his voice. I, man, I like that character. Might have to mess with the hair a little bit, but ugh, not bad. It looks kind of like Geralt from The Witcher. Mm, might not mess with it too much. Uh, let's see here. Maturity. Let's make him just slightly older. Let's go with 20% on that. A little refined. No freckles. No that. Eye color red. Ooh. What about some purple eyes? I like that, kind of, or maybe gray, ooh, and let's go purple, it's kind of cool. Alright, uh, tattoos, not much of a tattoo guy, nah, can I just look at them all, okay. These are all like face tats, huh, neck, nah. We'll go no tattoo. Uh, eye makeup. Let's take the makeup off. Lip tint red. Let's go with plum. I like the name of that. Scars. Again, more of a... Punch in the mouth and cut. Mm. If anything, it's going to be small. It's a small one on the chin there. It's too Geraltish. 
Me to go with that one. Nah. We'll go with it. How about a small one on the chin? I think there's a cut on his eye there. Let's go with that. Hairstyle Bardic Inspiration. Oh, he's got it all the way across his face. I don't like that. All right, we'll go with that one. Right across the lip and a little one on the top. All right. So many freaking haircuts. Too lame. <laughs> yeah, what was that one called? I like the first one. Shoot. Was it that? No. Like, am I building Geralt here? Okay, I, it was, okay, I saw that, and that was near it. That was it right there. Let's go with it. Fuck it. Uh, not white, though, okay? We, we gotta, we gotta deviate from Geralt a bit. Ooh, some orange hair, maybe? I even said, I'm not going to take the whole time on the character creation, it's all I can do. He doesn't look as cool as he did with the white hair though, huh? How about black red? Let's change his eyes then. Let's go back to that red. Ooh, right there. We have our guy. Anything else here? Genitals? Default? I mean, I can't even see him. Oh, there's the clothes. Uh, piercings? Not a big piercing guy. Let's see. But I gotta feel like the character might be a piercing guy. How about that? Those look cool. Yeah, let's do that. That looks like my dude there. Oh, gentles, do we look at it? Penis B? All right, we gotta look at it. Oh, hope I don't get... <laughs> let's go with the, no, I can't go with the default. <laughs> We'll go with that one. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> All right, here we go. I did not see that the first time. Uh, all right, his appearance is set. <laughs> uh, sub race, okay, so here we go. Uh, now we're gonna figure out a little more about him. So raised, we already read that. Oh, okay, here we go. This one can be found seeking allies from all over aiming to settle their conflict and each other by any means necessary oh it is different okay raised by lulz cult in the city of uh menzo barazin these drow embody the virtues of their corrupt and merciless goddess lulz marks her followers with bright red eyes, so those in the Underdark will learn to fear them on sight. Huh, pretty cool. No, yeah, this. Did that change my appearance? No! I don't think it did. No, that's it, right there. Bright red eyes, wow, did it know I have red eyes? I've heard this game does that. Okay, here we go. I wanna be a, so he's already good with a sword, right? Uh, now we kind of figure out, and this has a lot to do with what happens on the right with our uh, stats. Oh, it looks like the clothes too. 
fighter, not just a fighter, no. We gotta do some cool stuff. Okay, that outfit is so bad, I don't know if I can do it. Okay, so this guy has healing. Attack roll. Hmm. I kind of want to be like a, a sorcerer, right? But I, but I also got to have a little... Oh, how cool does that look? Daggers, quarterstaff. I can inspect it. This game is so deep, man. I got all those... Oh, God, this is awesome. Man, a warlock, oh man, light armor, simple weapon, got a few spells, one beam of crackling energy, oh man, sorry, I'm overwhelmed, it's, it's awesome, alright, is there one in between, this is sneaky, I don't want to do this, Not doing sneak. Let's uh, get some out. Uh, Ranger. I, I'm guessing this is the uh, the bow. No. Nah. Hammer. Heavy arm, like a tank almost. Nah. Oh my goodness, that's just the worst outfit. I hope I can. I am. A sh I'm sure I can change it, but I. Ugh. Monk, what? No, we're, we can't. I, I just can't do it. Uh, Druid, here we go. Wow, look at this one. This one has all kinds of proficiencies with different things, all kinds of. What is this? Magical. A thorn whip. An ice knife. Thunder wave. Curing. Speak to ant. Okay, druid. It, I, if I if I'm not a druid, I'm gonna be tripped out. Mm. They're always prepared. Okay, let's look at this. Create or destroy water. Oh my god. Uh, cleric and druid. So far, I don't want to be a bard. Uh, I don't know. Okay, let's go with. Cleric. Right? Was that it? Any connection to my. Or, I'm sorry, druid. Speak with animals. I love that. Charm someone. Do I get all these like right away? Yep. Oh my goodness. Yeah, okay, we're a druid. I also hate the outfit, but I hope I can change it. Oh, I hate that outfit. Spear guy, huh? Or what is this? No, spear, sickle, scimitar. Yeah, scimitar. This is. Dagger club. Medium armor. I love medium armor. Shield, too, if I need a shield. Alright, here we go. Uh, let me just look one more time at Cleric. Medium armor, shield, Morningstar, and simple weapons. I can't, I'm not just gonna go based on the looks here. Oh, and you can change these two. Th this is out of control. Alright, we're gonna go with the Druid. I like being the nature, with one with nature. Let's see. Oh no, what was it? Shoot. No. 
Change your cantrip selection by choosing the spell list below. Cantrips don't use spell slots. We cast at will. Okay, cool. Produce a flame in your hand. Okay, I like fire. More resistant to spells and conditions. Wow, that would actually probably be pretty good. This is one I already got. Thorn Whip pulls the creature closer. Uh, get over here, almost, huh? One to six damage. Your staff or club becomes magical. I'm probably not going to use staffs and clubs a lot. More resistant to magic for ten turns. That one. Spellbook. Prepared spells. I wonder what the difference is. Healing. Entangle. Wait, I don't know if I want that whip. Uh, ability checks. Poisons. Man, poison is so deadly in a lot of games, but a flame in your hand sheds a light in a nine meter radius that deals one when thrown. Immediately does not cost an action. So do I just kind of pair two together maybe and make them super brutal? I don't care about them being closer. Maybe I do. But sometimes maybe you don't want them close. A puff of noxious gas. can't be pulled if huge in size. I feel like most can be poisoned. Kinda wanna see how this looks though. <laughs> uh, three meters, that's not that much. I'll go with poison. you conjure it does not cost an action until long rest <laughs> I love that all right let's go poison and thorn whip I like it all right uh, known spells Create or destroy water. Okay, I definitely want to like. At least it pushes. Pushes things away. Okay, healing is good. What's the point of this? Conjure four magical berries into your companion's inventory. Creatures. Eat a berry. Eh, I, I'm getting rid of a berry. Where's the animal one? Ice knife. Ooh, that could be a brutal one. Explodes and deals two to tw cast where you're silenced. I have this one. Create a vine service slowing down, possibly entangling them. I'm taking that out. Uh, let's see here. Blinds and heavily obscures creatures within it. That could be helpful. I want that. Convince him not to do it. This is more of a... Okay, so I want a heal spell. I want an attack spell as well. Pushes them away. I don't know if that's going to be great. Let's do charm. I like when you get to talk to things and make them do things. Hmm. Alright, so here we go. Heal. This is probably the one I want to get rid of, and I think I'm going to do the ice thing. What's this? Call forth rain or destroy a water-based surface. Uh, good berry, no. Trap. 
triple a creature. Wow. Increase a creature's movement. Nah, let's just go with an attack and the ability to talk to two. Okay. Oh, it keeps going. All right, and I like it. Uh, I wish I had more intelligence on the right, but it looks like I have a lot of wisdom. Um, yeah, okay. You spent your life in service to a temple, learning sacred rites, and providing sacrifices to the gods or gods you worship, serving the gods. No. Charlatan, you're an expert in manipulation, prone to exaggeration, more happy to profit from it. Bending the truth and turning allies against each other will lead to greater... Ooh, that's kind of cool. Criminal. Uh, I don't want to be a criminal. Uh, entertainer. Subvert your engaging common crowds in high society, preserving art and bring joy... Mm, not, doesn't really fit my character. Champion of the common people, challenging tyrants and monsters to protect the helpless. Okay, kind of like that. Guild Artisan. Your skill in a particular craft has earned you the membership to a mercantile. Guild offering privileges of protection while engaging in your art, repairing, and just... No. Noble. No. Outlander. Grew up in the wilds learning to survive far from the comforts of civilization. Surviving unusual hazards of the wild will enhance... Hmm. You're curious and well-read. I don't want to be that. Soldier. I haven't served in the militia. No. Uh, I'm gonna make the most out of very little. What street? Uh, I kind of played one of those. How about a charlatan? Lie and cheat. Manipulate the truth. Sleight of hand. Steal stuff. Ugh. Pick locks, pick pockets. Disarm traps. Okay, I do like that. I guess I could steal things occasionally, too, eh? Alright, let's be a charlatan. It's kind of like a thief, though. Eh, hold on. Folk hero. No. 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 Recognize magic, interact with enchanted items. Remember the past of the world and its people. Actually, the charlatan seems kind of cool, even though I kind of dismissed the thief, or the criminal. Let's look at the criminal real quick. I dismissed it way too quick. Oops. Go with charlatan. Okay. Abilities. Oh my goodness. We're, we're not done. Okay. I'm gonna take one from that and put one here. I, <laughs> memory and meant improve spell castings for wizards. Cleric's druid. Okay, got it. That's why. I just hate being a big dummy. Bards, paladins, sorcerers, and warlocks. Maximum hit points, okay. I'm gonna go one more on strength, because I, I do want to have a little wisdom. Oh, this kind of... There we go. Skills. And we got them. Let's go. We're done. How do I... Choices pending. Abilities. Dang it. How do I like say, okay, fine, let's do this, jeez. Review character, name, rename. 
Let's call him. <laughs> what should we call him? Let's look up a name. A cool name. Let's name him Godwin. After one of my favorite football players, Chris Godwin. Choose ne next, choose guardian. Oh, okay. Here we go. I don't know what that means. Okay, that looks like an awesome guardian. Let's go with her. Yes. Venture forth. Woo! That took a while. Here we go. Right, here we go. I feel like I say here we go a lot. Wow. A lot of dragons, a lot of demons, a lot of, a lot of violence.
I'm ready to dive right in. I think I'm pretty happy with the character I made. I gotta change that outfit, but there he is. Well, I think I'm going to just make a new video, starting with the gameplay, because uh, that character creation took long enough. So, um, Thanks for watching. We'll be back soon, and we can actually play this awesome game.